We've really tried our hardest in terms of the live performance side to put on a show. Sometimes you have to invest into your craft and into yourself. Sometimes it's not about the money. The money will come back. People start hollering for major headline festivals and then you start making the money from that. Obviously, I never had a job or anything when I decided to do this. I literally said to myself, this has to work. I didn't think, like worry about oh, making peas, doing this, or let me go do this. No, I made sure that my next income is going to be from music. And that's, that's what got me the mentality of just making it happen. Sometimes you got to force the progression and that's, that's what it was for me, yeah. I'd say it's, bro, it's like 15% music, bro, like 85% other things, bro, marketing and all of this stuff. So you can be as talented as you want. I know you guys have all seen it, bro. There's a lot of ta talented artists that just get slept on because it's not, it's not all about talent, innit? You got to kind of strip it back and think about the business one of the key things outside of money is knowledge. So also while you're transitioning, understanding how you actually get paid for music. Artists only think that it's just streaming, but really there's so many other ways. All your spare time should be going into your craft. It's a lot of work. It was amazing. I had a great time. I met some really cool people, people you wouldn't meet ordinarily. If I didn't come today, the connections that I would have made would not even exist. If you want to get into music, you probably should come. <laughs> yeah. Come to the next one. Amazing. Thank you, right.